Hello everyone and welcome back to the Crypto Spartan YouTube channel where we will be diving into another detailed crypto analysis. This video will be a follow up to my review of Cloudbrick published a few weeks ago. I got a lot of positive feedback and interest in the project so we're going to take another deep dive into Cloudbrick here. If you haven't seen my previous review of Cloudbrick where I dive into the project's background, vision, solution and team then you might want to do so before continuing here so you're fully clued up about the project's fundamentals. This video is a detailed report style piece in which we will delve deep into an exploration of the future evolution of the digital landscape, the challenges and threats we are likely to encounter and what it will take to confidently secure our digital future. As usual I will be scrolling through some of the resources from the team such as the website and white paper and so on in order to show you how they present their project and vision and so you can see where to look for more information on specific aspects of the project. On this occasion, for the purposes of this analysis, I will also be scrolling through a couple of external references relating to some of the wider issues at play. Standard disclaimer, this is not financial advice in any form. It is my opinion and insight based on research and you should always do your own research before committing to anything financially whatsoever. I am an academic and entrepreneur, specialising in crypto investments mainly, and I do a lot of research for my own use, the most interesting of which I like to share with you guys. With that out of the way, let's commence. Cloudbrick in the future of cybersecurity, securing an uncertain digital landscape. The rate of technological advancement driven by humans is staggering, and in many fields is growing exponentially. There are, without doubt, numerous groundbreaking technologies and accompanying fields of research which will come to shape tomorrow's world beyond what we can comprehend today. Artificial intelligence, blockchain and IoT enabled devices are merely a few examples which, together especially, have the potential to be unfathomably disruptive to various aspects of the human experience, both on a personal and industrial level. It is truly an exciting time to be alive, but as technology continues to become increasingly pervasive and intertwined with daily life, there is also much cause for concern. Not only is there a whole new generation of threats and challenges resulting from the exploration of groundbreaking technologies, but traditional cybersecurity solutions have proven themselves fundamentally incapable of effectively protecting against even today's threats. The current mechanism of centralised solutions leave them fundamentally flawed. A truly revolutionary approach to the issue is certainly required if we are to be able to have a confidently secure future. Where the future begins, the challenges of cybersecurity today, a ticking time bomb. Even before we venture further into the unknowns of technological advancement and adoption, there are various factors which make the field of cybersecurity today a battlefield in which the enemy always fundamentally has the upper hand. It is crucial to understand these issues in order to plan for a truly secure digital future. The centralised cybersecurity model is broken. The current situation of the cybersecurity solutions industry has proven traditional mechanisms to be outdated and fundamentally broken. Large players in the market defensively hoard their vast amounts of harvested data for reasons of profiteering and attempting to retain a market edge in a fundamentally flawed industry, with dire consequences for others within the ecosystem. Threat data, which combined from multiple sources would give significantly better insight into such threats is currently not being used for its full value, if at all. Smaller pools of data are hugely less effective at detection and prevention of threats and attacks than a comprehensive pool. Increasingly ineffective security. The rate and sophistication of hacks and attacks being carried out globally each year is nothing short of staggering, and only promises to get worse. As centralised solutions remain fundamentally limited in their effectiveness due to their very model of operation, Hackers are learning to adopt increasingly intelligent methods of attack. With the limited self-generated pools of data the primary source of intelligence for dealing with malicious actors, current security solutions are not equipped to effectively predict and prevent attacks from happening, instead all too often relying on a responsive approach. As hacks and attacks become more severe, this purely responsive approach is becoming no longer viable. The sheer number of specifically tailored security solutions only serves to exacerbate the situation as consumers are left confused and ultimately unprotected. Tomorrow's challenges, next-gen technology, next-gen threats. Responding to a future catastrophic attack after the event 
may be nearly as useful as not having any security mechanism in place whatsoever. Instead, a truly intelligent and ever-evolving proactive security solution such as CloudBrick is crucially required. This fact becomes more pressing as we continue to advance deeper into greater aspects of technological advancement and adoption. Not only will traditional hackers continue to employ new and more intelligent tactics, but new areas of technology will become potentially much more dangerous targets of attack. IoT devices. Most of us understand the importance of cybersecurity today, even though many of us do not feel compelled to ensure their digital lives are truly secure. However, it is important now to protect our mobile phones and PCs against malicious actors looking to steal data or otherwise exploit our devices, then what about when the majority of electronic items you interact with in both your home and at work environments are consistently collecting data from you and your surroundings? Even fridges today are becoming laced with tech and home devices are becoming IoT, Internet of Things, ready at an impressive rate. The extensive amount of data potentially able to be collected by malicious actors looking to exploit such technology is one matter, but gaining access to the functionalities of such items, depending on the specific device targeted, could be potentially presenting new technological and physical dangers on another level. Blockchain space. Cyber attacks and security risks are most pertinent in newly formed or fledgling industries in which there is little established in the way of dedicated protection solutions. A clear example of this is the blockchain space, fraught with malicious actors looking to exploit and profit from vulnerable technologies in new and untested environments. The space is notorious for its consistently high profile personal and exchange related hacks and attacks. This is not only a hindrance to those currently active in the space, but is also contributing to the negative side of the public image of cryptocurrency and thus is ultimately contributing to a slow mass adoption. Many average people, accustomed to the bank looking after their money for them, are unwary about the concept of true autonomy over their own funds, let alone the relatively high risk of hacks or attacks. For Joe Bloggs to happily place a large portion of his net worth into cryptocurrency, he would need assurance of an actively secure user environment. Breaking new ground, advancing into uncertain territory. Whenever there is technological advancement pushing the boundaries of possibility, there are always opportunistic malicious actors not too far behind. As technology begins to harness advanced capabilities beyond what is humanly possible, deeper security concerns necessarily rise to the surface. We must create a truly effective overall mechanism for ensuring cybersecurity, or else remain at the mercy of hackers possibly capable of presenting currently unfathomable threats on both a personal and industrial level. What will it take to future-proof cybersecurity? Cloudbrick's decentralized approach. Cloudbrick's solution was analyzed in my previous video, but merely in relation to current industry challenges. Vastly more important, however, is how Cloudbrick's revolutionary approach is built to protect us against the plethora of unknowns as we proceed deeper into human technological advancement. Ever evolving and intelligently proactive is deep learning. The key factor in future-proofing a solution in an industry as rapidly evolving as the cybersecurity industry is to equip the solution with the means to itself rapidly evolve alongside, as opposed to purely in response to, the changing threat landscape. Cloudbrick have achieved this with the, the use of their innovative deep learning module known as Vision, which will effectively amalgamate and analyse th the threat data being contributed to the network. Vision will thus be equipped to detect a whole new generation of cyber threats and therefore effectively prevent cyber attacks and more. This sophisticated deep learning mechanism will be the backbone of Cloudbrick's intelligent ecosystem. Blockchain and decentralized threat data. The everyday online activity of both individuals and organizations produces a huge amount of valuable threat data which, as we have explored, is traditionally hoarded by big industry players in a way which is not sustainable if truly secure online future is to be achieved. Cloudbrick's disruptive operational model promises to rectify the problems caused by insular centralized industry actors and inherently open and tr transparent decentralized approach to threat data will allow for the amalgamation and analysis of a relatively extremely comprehensive and rich pool of data. This in turn will contribute to the continuous improvement of the platform's vision deep learning module, 
which will then be able to provide a more effective security solution across the whole ecosystem. Comprehensive community-driven ecosystem As a decentralized solution, community participation is an integral part to the effective functioning of various key aspects of the ecosystem. Users will be able to take advantage of the CloudBrick Security Rewards Program, whereby they will be incentivized for their participation with CLB tokens in two different ways. Users will be able to seamlessly contribute anonymized threat data to the CloudBrick network, thus informationally strengthening the ecosystem in the process, or alternatively can receive CLB token distributions by contributing information to the CloudBrick Labs community, a workshop for the development of security-related ideas, tools and insight thereby adding valuable insight and ideas to the network. This tokenized incentivization model for participation within the ecosystem is an integral part of many successful decentralized solutions and does much to promote a healthy growth, satisfaction and participation of community overall, thus ensuring an increasingly effective next-gen security solution. By offering a powerful all-in-one cybersecurity ecosystem as opposed to the traditional specialized and fragmented approach, CloudBrick will be able to seamlessly offer security solutions encompassing new and emerging areas of technology such as blockchain and IoT as effectively as that of areas traditionally of security concerns. Truly a platform built to be future-proof. Conclusion Next-Gen Security for a Next-Gen World The advancement of human technological achievement has been at once exciting, staggering and alarming. Today this is true more so than ever before, as we continue into unknowns of technological territories, a truly secure next generation cybersecurity solution such as that proposed by CloudBrick is certainly required if we are to be able to tackle current pressing problems and prepare for a confidently secure digital future. Utilising the groundbreaking technologies of blockchain and AI in the form of their innovative vision deep learning mechanism, CloudBrick will be able to effectively prevent and react to threat data in ways never before possible and will inherently consistently evolve as the network becomes more intelligent, thus presenting a more effective solution. Focusing as heavily on their community-powered approach as much as on their technological prowess, CloudBrick is building not only a platform but an entire decentralized ecosystem which promises to tackle the crippling problems inherent in the traditional cybersecurity space with their reimagined model of proactive and future-proof cybersecurity. The core long-term strength of CloudBrick's solution is the inherently key role of user participation within the ecosystem. The incentive-based structure for participating and adding value to the cybersecurity ecosystem is refreshing to see in an industry so traditionally insular and profit-hungry, and will contribute to the growth of a healthy and active user base and community. CloudBrick is promising a truly next-generation solution to enable a much more fundamentally secure and refreshingly more rewarding digital future. KYC is currently open for those looking to partake in the second round of their pre-sale, scheduled for the 13th to the 22nd of September or until the hard cap is reached. I wish CloudBrick the best of luck in their upcoming token sales. And as always, I will certainly be watching with a keen eye as they progress on their journey to revolutionize the cybersecurity space. If you have any questions about CloudBrick, I'd recommend joining their Telegram community where you can discuss anything CloudBrick related or learn more at their website where you can also find their white paper for some deeper research. So I'll leave a link to both in the description. What do you guys think about CloudBrick? Do you like the concept? Do you have any queries? Leave a comment and join the discussion. If you found my video useful or interesting, please be sure to give it a like and subscribe to my channel where I'm back with regular updates on some of the most interesting new blockchain projects which I come across during my mountains of ICO and crypto research.